Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Lana and Andrea, and I'm here because I want to show you guys personally and technically a very, very detailed lesson on how I do these individual um, single eyelashes. I'm gonna call them single eyelashes because I did a tutorial long time ago on how to do the individual eyelashes. Individual eyelashes are. I'm gonna explain the difference. Okay, so the individual eyelashes are like these. And um, as you can see, the individual eyelashes are a cluster of eyelashes. It's like maybe three or four or five or six or however many. A cluster of eyelashes that you attach as one. So for each one of these individual eyelashes that I will put on, I would attach five or six eyelashes. But, you know, I'm only putting it on once. But because it's five or six eyelashes in each eyelash, each individual, you get a fuller look, but it's less natural and they don't last as long. I'm not sure why they don't last as long, but for me, they don't last as long as this. Okay, so the difference, and I don't even have the singles to show you, but I'll probably put a picture here or something. Individual eyelashes have a bunch of little strands. The eyelashes that I use for this look, they are single. So it's one strand, one eyelash by itself. Not like the individuals where it's like seven or eight. I hope y'all follow. So basically, um, in shops or if you have like a personal or eyelash lady, she will charge you between $80 and $150 to do these. They last four to six weeks, but after about three weeks, you'll need to touch up. The touch up will probably be like $70 to $100, depending on what you like, who you go to, and how um, expensive the person is. I went to the beauty supply and I bought these single eyelashes. I got mine in medium black. They are... Dura Lash by Ardell, and I don't have the pack anymore, but I'll insert a picture. Um, they were two seventy nine. The eyelash glue that I used, I'll put a picture. The eyelash glue that I used, and I think I showed it in the video, but that eyelash glue was like two seventy nine. Also, so five dollars. And for me, it doesn't take as long. When I got mine professionally done, it took about three or four hours. I actually fell asleep a few times while the lady was doing my eyelashes, which was a bit annoying. But um, for me, it took about 30 minutes. And I have full eyelashes. The only problem that I did experience, which you'll see in the video, was that uh, I did my curly eye. This is the side I sleep on. So this eye, uh, this eye has eyelashes that are a bit more curly. But... Uh, other than that, I'm very satisfied with my results, and I hope that you stick around to watch the video. I don't want this intro to be too long, but follow me on Snapchat, London.Andrea. Follow me on Instagram, London.Andrea. Follow me everywhere, like my Facebook fan page, and make sure you take the time to subscribe. I really appreciate you subscribing. I'm talking really fast and really weird because I have a cold, and I don't want to cough or do anything gross, so I hope you enjoy the video. You want to start by making sure that your face is washed and your eyelashes are clean. You want to make sure that your tools are clean, make sure your tweezers are clean, make sure everything is clean so that you don't get a eye infection. Here I'm just straightening my eyelashes so much to where I can get them to be even and full as possible. So when I add the eyelash extensions, I can get one eyelash extension per natural eyelash. So if you see, I'm taking the tweezers and I'm matching my eyelashes one by one with the extension. So for each one of my natural eyelashes, I'm matching one individual eyelash. You see me, I'm just taking the bottom of the tweezers and adjusting them and moving them around according to how my natural eyelashes flow. I'm sorry it got a little bit out of focus, but there's a couple of things that you want to do and don't do. So do wash your face, but make sure for the first 48 hours you don't come in any direct contact with water other than like your natural um, eye moisture, but you don't want to submerge them in any water because you want them to last as long as possible. Make sure that you do comb them out every day like you saw me do with the brush, and make sure that you always, always, always sanitize your hands or your utensils before you put anything in your eye. You don't want to sleep on your face because you will cause them to curl and they will look a bit crazy and unkept. Here you see with my other hand I'm taking my index finger and I'm kind of moving it around to pull my eyelid taut up, upward so that I can see my waterline in my eye. That way I don't make a mistake and poke myself in the eye because if you do poke yourself it will burn. Here is the finished product. Make sure you hit the like button if you enjoyed this tutorial. If you would like to see how I add more eyelashes later on, 
make sure you comment below. I'ma give you all my affection Every touch becomes infectious